Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Christelle, and today we're going to be continuing on with our Dark Souls 1 remastered playthrough. This is part number 19, so if you have not watched previous episodes, definitely going to watch those ones first. I'll actually leave the full playlist link for this playthrough down below in the description box, and all my social links will be down there as well. Alright, so for today, I'm thinking that we will actually be heading into the catacombs. The only other time I've actually been inside of the catacombs was on my very first day playing, when I didn't know how to sprint, and I didn't know that that area was definitely over leveled for me, so I'm a little bit nervous, but also really excited to finally be able to kind of go inside and see what it's all about. As always, we will be streaming this live on Twitch, so if you're still checking them inside and talking to people, that is why. Also, if you're subscribed to me on YouTube, give us a thumbs up. If you're not liking it, it helps me a lot. Otherwise, we're just going to get started. Hello, Andre. Long time no see. Actually, you know what? Because we went into the painting too and we found that other ember. I wonder if they'll have anything to say about it. Because it said that that dark ember thing, no living person had heard of or seen. Show me that ember of yours. Well... I've never heard of a black ember. Oh. Hmm. How about leaving that ember with me? I find it strangely fascinating. Do you think he'll turn evil? Oh, okay, sure. Yes. Well, thank you. This ember really is something special. I'm already under its spell. Oh I no. Sense great potential, indeed. I wonder if that's gonna make him turn evil later. That'd be kinda cool makes him go hollow. Oh, but then I can't level anything up. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> Maybe I should have given it to the giant blacksmith in Anorlando because he was been like around for ages. Maybe he would have known something about it. Let's just see if the divine weapon sword does so little damage. Oh god. Oh my god. Blood loss. I'm fucking dead. Bro. <laughs> We've got a storage straight sword to plus three now. So it does 104 physical damage and 104 magical damage plus the 120 of divineness. <laughs> Anyways, so hopefully maybe that will be enough. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna test the divine weapon. Let's see how it feels. And if it feels like it's still not enough damage, I might just run in with my claymore. You know, it does okay, like three hits. That's pretty okay. It's not great, but it's okay. I am going to try and sprint in because <laughs> it worked pretty well last time. Into the catacombs. Let's see if I remember. What are those? Oh God. Oh God. What the fuck are those? Were those there the first time? I don't think so. Okay. And I remember there was a platform here, so I'm just going to roll in. And then I remember this is a dead end, so I'm just running. <laughs> I don't think I have been, yeah, I haven't been past here. So, hello? Oh God, are you, yeah, you're an enemy. I wasn't sure if it was a merchant. Okay, goodbye. Oh, campfire. Oh, fuck off. Can I light this? <laughs> As, I, as long as I do this before he gets back up, right? Okay, that was easier than I expected, honestly. The claymore was the way to go. I wasted my time doing the other stuff, I think. Lots of people do this area as their first post-tutorial zone because the reward is so nice. Oh, really? I feel like if you played this game before and know how the catacombs work, then I could probably see it. But like, as a first timer, I definitely don't think I would have made it if I tried to get here on my own. Push lever, sure. What did that do? I mean, I saw the thing behind here drop down. Oh, maybe that is like a wall or something up top? Ah, I see. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Let's fucking go. Wow, this looks very different from what I was expecting. Hello. Oh. Oh. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. <laughs> I'm leaving. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, goodbye. 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 Shit, I've had enough! Is there anything down below? Those are the like floating skull things I saw in the beginning too. Okay, and there's an area. Oh, I forgot they rebuild. I gotta go. Hello? Hey, get back here! Oh, nice, that killed him. I'm almost dead though. I need a heal. I need a heal. I need a heal. Heal twice, two, three times. Oh, oh my god. Hey, chill! Chill the fuck out! Good heavens, I have no stamina. I gotta heal. Are you guys rebuilding? Shit. 
fuck off. Okay, they're not rebuilding. I think if you kill the mage thing, then they don't respawn. This is kind of sad. All the bodies. I wonder who all of these people were, if they were like important or not. Well, that sounds kind of rude. <laughs> like lore wise, I mean. I'm very curious about all of these little bugs that are everywhere as well. I wonder if they lead anywhere. Okay, I need to break all the pots just in case there's loot. Oh, hi. I didn't even see him there. Oh, maybe there's a way around I can go up to get him. Oh, there's a staircase right there too. I wonder if you get over there if you can jump down onto that staircase. I don't think I should be going here yet, but that's uh, definitely thinking something to keep in mind for later, I think. Okay, Lucerne. Lucerne? Lucerne. Oh, I just got par- I didn't know skeletons could parry you. Oh, did he just get back up? These might be from a different a different guy. I'm gonna leave then. I'm just gonna <laughs> I'm just gonna mosey along here. That's quite all right. Okay, I went left. There was also a path that you can go right. Oh, there is an outdoor here. Oh, I wonder where this goes. Oh god. Oh god. Oh. Huh? Okay. 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 Bob me. Bob me. Bob me. <laughs> Okay, there is a lever there, and I also see a soul. Hey, there's a guy over there! Soul of a proud knight. Oh, god. Okay, fuck off, y'all. Get out of here. I've had enough. There's a guy on the other side. I don't think I can get to him. We might have to come back. No? There's a campfire on that side, too. Oh, god. Okay, we gotta go. I gotta go. Okay, 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 okay. Push the lever and leave. Actually, wait, let me heal. <laughs> Actually, wait, let me- I'm gonna- I'm gonna use my- my divine sword. <laughs> they are just absolutely blocking the shit out of me. Okay, let's push the lever and uh, I'll just keep running, I think. I don't know what that does, but we pushed it. Okay, pardon me. Excuse me, pardon me. <laughs> pardon me, excuse me. Oh! Oh, god. Is this the spikes? Was this the spiky bridge? I'm unsure. Oh, there's your fucking- oh shit, I'm fucked. That's where his, their fucking spooky boy is. Okay. Okay, so the Lucerne- I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right, apologies if I'm not. Halberd with a large, hard beak-like protrusion. Oh, really? Instead of thrusting like a spear, the wielder of the Lucerne aims to club the head with its hard beak. Oh, okay, I see. Oh my goodness. Okay, so just like regular halberds. The stats are pretty similar to my like upgraded regular halberd. I don't think there's really much use of me using this one other than if I really need like an overhead attack or something. Um, how did I get over there? Oh my god. Okay. These guys do respawn then. That's interesting. Ay. Okay, I gotta go. Uh, okay, I went to the left, so I'm gonna go back to the left again. I did see as well. Here it was. Yeah, there was also the st Oh, there's a door there too. Okay, fuck it. Fuck it. I'm jumping here. Ow. Okay. There was also stairs on the other side though. Oh god. <laughs> Maybe I should have come here. Um, secret wall? No first. Okay. Oh, is this where the stairs was? What? What is this area? Oh, there is someone behind that. Huh? Wait. But this is not a secret wall. Oh, maybe I can parry him. Oh, I can. Let's go. That's better. There's got to be a reason you can come here because it has the stairs that you can like, it looks like you know, purposely you can jump on this, but it also has the doorway to this and you can attack things through this. Oh, I see. Yeah, I need to fucking remember to look down. Can I make that? Okay, oh God, <laughs> spooky. Oh, there's, oh, I see, I see, great Sith. Okay, I think this is where the other guy was or maybe this is somewhere else. No, this is somewhere else, there's a thing there. Okay, hello. This feels like a trap. Is there a secret wall? That or the fucking floor is gonna cave in. I don't trust this room one bit. Okay, Great Scythe is a weapon with a long curved blade converted from a wheat, wheat harvesting tool. Okay, yes. The magnificent sharp curved blade instills fear in its opponents. Perhaps it is their survival instincts at work. Got a overhead and a swing, it seems. Okay, I'm gonna press this lever. 
because I don't know what it does, but I feel like the levers are probably maybe more important. Didn't seem to do anything that time, actually. Okay. Oh my god. Hi. All right. Where does this go? Oh my. Oh, okay. Well, he just jumped off. That's fine. Okay, I can go down. Hmm. Maybe not. Oh, there's a soul down there. <laughs> Mm, I don't know if this is a bait. Maybe there's a platform. I wish I had a fucking flashlight. Okay, before I go down there, let me see if there is anything up here first. Uh, okay, that's a skelly boy. Oh, fucking hell. Jesus, he scared me. Let me get this soul here. <laughs> Ow. Okay, asshole. Oh, there's a sorcery boy. Hi, are you a little bit stuck there? <laughs> Yeah, fuck. Oh, okay, we're on the other side of the bridge because that's my souls. Ah, I see, I see. Okay, okay, okay. So it all just kind of loops around. Thank God, because otherwise I would get far too lost if there was no way to like get back over. There's a platform over there and a door. Oh, and a white wall. Oh, God. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, there was... Where were we? Was it over there? Yeah, there was a guy over there that we saw. Is that the same guy? Oh, there's a thing over there. Do you think that's a secret wall? Shit, there's so many areas I have to go. Okay, hold on. Let's go back over here. That just looks like a... <laughs> oh shit, it actually is. Okay, there's also a ladder here. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, fuck. I forgot. <laughs> I immediately, immediately forgot. I was too excited. Okay. Ah, there's a bonfire here. Okay. Yeah, we saw this through the fucking cracks in the thing, so I was thinking. Okay, very cool, very cool. Okay, I want to find where that guy was. Oh yeah, you, there was a ladder here, I forgot. Okay, let's go up here. I'd argue this is one of the most missable bonfires. Oh, really? Hello? Are you friendly? Hey, Hello? You look reasonably sane. What are you doing in the catacombs? Are you a cleric or something? A cleric? No. Oh, I know what it is. You've come for the trinkets, haven't you? Yeah. Well, whatever it is. This place 100%. is treacherous. Do watch your step. Thanks. <laughs> okay. Are you friendly? I mean, I'm like friendly to most of the NPCs for a while, at least. <laughs> what is this one for? Oh, so it makes the spiky bridge into the non-spiky bridge, but we had already- Oh, maybe that's what the other lever is that we pulled before. Okay, well, let me re-push it back. Sorry, sorry, sir. Um, <laughs> well, I phased through your body here. Wow, so we get a white wall already? That feels really fast. See a little door underneath the bridge to the left there as well? Unless that's where we were before, which is possible. No, I think we haven't been- Oh, hi. What was over here again, though? Was this... Oh, wait! This was... Okay, okay, okay. I was thinking the only other thing that I could think of was be this area. One at a time, please. One at a time. You're gonna jump at me? Oh, you're gonna roll. <laughs> so when they hit themselves against the thing, they break their bodies too. That's interesting. Was cleric like a type of starting class that you could have? Or is that just like... I imagine that's like if you're just a magic person and or a healer. Unless maybe if the like sorcery guys that are controlling the skeletons, maybe those guys are clerics? I'm not sure. I really want to know what the- Oh, these statues are for. Okay. Never mind. I don't care anymore. <laughs> okay, there's a lot of doorways, so I'm just gonna go left to right, because I think that's probably... Oh, no. Oh, okay, there's far too many of you here. Oh, shit. Okay, I'm gonna pick this up. Soul of a Proud Knight. Great. Fantastic. I love that for me. Okay, I'm gonna leave. I'm leaving. Oh, wait, this is where we were before. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, 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 okay. Um, there was also the right here. Oh, this was the thing I think it, I felt like was gonna fall through. Unless it's a different area that just looks exactly the same. Okay, get me out of here. Oh, so this is a different bridge. Oh, okay. I thought this was the bridge that that guy was at, but maybe it's something different. Can I drop onto that bridge then? Uh, I mean, it kind of looks like I can just drop on. Oh, this is the bridge that was there. 
Okay, let me heal. I don't know if I want to do a boss fight. We just got here. I feel like there was like a couple areas that I wanted to explore first. Um. Sir? Is that on a timer or did you flip that? Hello? <laughs> oh, well, how are you then? I slipped and flipped that little bit, you see. <laughs> It didn't cause you any trouble, by chance. It actually did not. Terribly troubled. Are you certain? Yeah, That's absolutely. A shame. I'm <laughs> truly sorry. Really? But wait now. You, you didn't actually fall down then. But why didn't you tell me sooner? Well. All's well that ends well. Everybody makes mistakes. I'm nobody has those all, days. I swear. I need <laughs> trusty patches. Patches. Oh, only. I know. They should make up for it. Okay, so Patches tried to fucking flip the switch on me. I'm I'm writing this down, Patches. I'm keeping my eye on you. Okay, cool. Well, he gave us the humanity. I'm dead outcasts. Fantastic, isn't it? Hmm. <laughs> Okay, considers himself an outcast. Putting it in the lore. I'm very curious because he asked me why I'm in here, but he didn't really tell me why he's in here or why he's trying to fucking kill me on the bridge. <laughs> because he even said like, oh, you didn't fall down then, which like, I feel like you wouldn't say unless you hoped that they would fall down, you know? There was an area where I was like, oh, I could do this or do this, and I didn't do one of them. Yeah, yeah, okay, this one went down, and I wanted to see if I could get the item. Oh, shit. At the bottom. Unless this is a different area? Oh, god. I'm losing track. Okay, leap of faith. Ow. Oh, actually, that is very helpful. I can barely see them just at the bottom there. They did seem to live. I might die here. I'm not gonna lie. Oh. Okay, there is a platform. Oh, <laughs> that's sneaky. I almost tried to sprint jump too. Okay, green titanite shard. All right, I'll take it. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, so this goes all the way down. What are they slashing at down there? Is there no way up? <laughs> okay, I think I have to go down then. Hello? Cutscene? I should have healed. Oh, I should have healed. Hello? Thick skeleton with some thick bone beard. God damn. Secret wall? <laughs> Be gone with you. That is not you the voice my focus. I was expecting. Spoil my focus. I did hear tinging. Maybe he's a blacksmith? Oh shit. Um, oh shit. Oh fuck, hold on. Heal. Oh my god, this is terrible timing. This is terrible, terrible timing. Hold on. I'm just gonna kill them with this so that I have time to heal. Oh, maybe they won't respawn. Okay, we're good. Okay, we're fine. <laughs> that would be awful if they killed me right there without the bonfire. Is this a secret bonfire? Because like, I honestly was contemplating if I should jump down or if that was something I had to come back to later. That's interesting. I still don't have nearly enough souls to upgrade anything, so, but I will gladly take that rest spot. The bonfire doesn't exist in the original and it makes the game worse in my opinion. Oh really? This is only in the remaster? That's interesting. Well, he did open this for us here. He doesn't seem like he wants us here, but he does seem to be a blacksmith. Why, you have an ember, do you? Ah, forget about it. I don't deal with that kind. Oh. What's gone wrong with embers these days? What kind of embers do you deal with? Okay, interesting. Um, I'm just gonna write it down that he's down here at all. Do you have anything else? I'm here to smith, not to chit chat. Okay, it doesn't like chit chat. I told you, I'm here for the trade, not for the talk. Yeah, but that's a different voice line, so I kind of think you're lying. Enough with your presence. It disturbs me. <laughs> one more time. Well, you are a persistent one, are you not? Yes, sir. I'm afraid I'm a mere blacksmith. It's just me and my trade. I would be of no help to a righteous warrior such as yourself. Oh, that sounded like a little bit of sass there. I told you, I have nothing to discuss. Then why if do you have different voice lines? Want, it's my smithing and nothing more. What if I, I want your friendship? That ember from New London, of course. It's a shame the whole place was flooded. Oh, okay. New Londo Ember. I'm writing it down and putting it in the lore. He's hoarding coffin lasagna. <laughs> yeah, he really is. It do look kind of tasty, though. <laughs> Hooking, honestly. I must say that I'm at my very limit. There's no more work to be done. Aww. Unless I have the flame of that legendary witch. 
Oh. Will require a visit to Lost Isolith. Impossible. Lost Isolith. I'm writing it down. I'm taking notes. Okay, yeah. So Witch of Isolith was one of the first like lords from the very uh, beginning prologue thing. She was the one who caused the firestorms and had the daughters of chaos. There was seven daughters pictured. We've only met two, if I recall, which was the spider bitch and then the fair lady spider bitch. So that's very interesting that he wants the flame of the witch of lost time lord. Also people say that the bonfire is the best part about the remaster but for me the cycle of struggle and triumph is the bulk of the reason for playing these games. The bonfire removes uh, most of the struggles from this area which in turn reduces the feeling of triumph in my opinion. Oh interesting. Yeah I can see both sides of that actually. I think there's definitely like some merit to like the struggle that you have to go through and like the feeling of like I fucking finally did it sort of thing. Though I've never played the one that doesn't have the bonfire or this one, so I can't really say which one is better or not, but there are definitely some areas where I feel like the struggle is a little bit more on the annoying side. But I, I also think it really depends on the area you're in and the the triumph reward, you know? Because some of the areas you struggle a lot in and it's for something that's very minimal or small. And so it doesn't end up feeling like a triumph. It just feels like you were like wasting time. But there are other areas areas where you struggle through and then you do feel really like okay that was definitely worth it sort of thing so yeah I can't really put my opinion on it I guess because I've never played either of them but I can definitely see like the the pros and cons of both I suppose. I for one am glad it's here because I hate doing the rerun part of things but there has been quite a few bonfires in this area I will say there's been a lot. Oh he can turn my halberd into a fire halberd. I might hold off on that for now but that's kind of that's good to know. Okay so he sells some homeward bones, tight knight shard, armor smith box which is for reinforcing your armor. I haven't really bothered to reinforce my armor to be honest so I don't know if I'm very interested in that. Also sells arrows which is good and bold and that's it okay i kind of thought he might sell more interesting stuff because he's down here but i mean homeward bone is honestly just nice to have at all what was that about don't be coming around here without a good reason wow he's a very grumpy one huh i, I kind of wonder why he chose this place to be in with like all these fucking coffins oh this one's open hey can i get in there take a little a little snooze all the other ones are closed though, that's interesting. Okay, well, I guess I'll be seeing you then. Uh, I don't think I can do anything else in here. Oh, these are- oh, fuck, no, no. Oh, we've got the spooky wheel boys, spooky wheel boys. Okay, there's a loot up there. I need to run. I need to get through this area. Okay, okay, spooky skeleton boys. Fuck, shit, fuck. Oh, I am gonna fuck. This is probably- I feel like this is why they probably added this uh, bonfire. Can I go in here? No, that looks like a secret. Oh my god. Hey, can y'all fucking schmove? I gotta go. Oh shit. Oh, I missed. Oh my god. Oh, his spooky boy's right there. Uh, why does this come here? Oh, there's a ladder. Oh shit. Oh, oh, god. oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Holy hell, dude. They fucking hurt. What the fuck? Is there any spooky boys up here? Okay, hold on, I gotta heal. Okay, what is this for? Oh, this one's open here too. Maybe the open ones are- Oh! Maybe the open ones are just normal. I was thinking maybe I could like, get a soul or something from it. There we go, just kick him off. <laughs> this one looks different. Oh, this one's small. Do you think this is a child's uh, tomb? This looks- No? Oh, that looks so sussy. Oh, climb. Did they follow me up? I didn't think they could climb the Oh no, these are not the wheel boys, that's why. Okay. <gasps> soul. Large soul. Nice. Take it. Uh, it's fucking dark in here. Hello? Any secret walls? Maybe I should just kill these guys if they're gonna keep coming back. Oh god. There we go. <laughs> I wanna be able to like look around in some of these areas. There we go. There we go. Okay. Okay. Sleep, sleep. All right. <laughs> okay. What is this area here? More tombs. These ones are pulled out of the walls. Do you think maybe these are the ones of all the little skelly boys or something? <laughs> it's really small, but I see. Maybe not. Maybe it's just a texture thing. 
Oh no, that's definitely okay. All right, hi, 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 hi. Okay, um, that's great. There's a Titanite demon down here. I'm just gonna look the other way because um, I don't trust that. Oh, this one got fucked up, dude. <laughs> it's so dark in here. I don't trust this one bit. These ones are all pushed in still. Okay, where does this come out? Can I kill these? I wonder. Where am I? Oh, this is the path that goes under. Why are there so many of you here? Um, can I kill these? No, I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think so. Okay. Oh, uh, I kind of want to go back and kill that demon titan I think too. Ow, bitch. Oh my god. Okay, we'll we'll go back there in a sec. I I just wanna ooh, I just wanna see where, where we're going here. Hey! Secret? Holy sh Oh fuck! I didn't get a chance to read the message. What did it say? No! Okay, that one I'm not online, so that's probably like a scripted thing, but I wanted to see what it said. No! Okay. Oh that's a big boy. I see a soul in there. Can I get in that? Dark Moon Seance Ring. <gasps> is this some? Um... Oh fuck! It's kind of hard to see, but I see her toes. Is this? Uh, is this uh, the the big lady? Wait, I want to see it better. Oh my god! Hold on, I need to heal. Shit! I might die. I might die here. I just want to see what it'll. Is that her? Oh, maybe that's somebody different. I thought maybe <laughs> blood loss. Excuse me, pardon me, excuse me, pardon me. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, I'm dead. Fuck. I, I thought it might have been um, the, the, the half-breed dragon lady that we saw last time in the painting, but I can't tell if it's for sure the same person or not. Oh god. Okay, well at least we're not that far away. I'll take it. Okay, so we got the Dark Moon Seance Ring. This ring is granted to adherents of Gwendolyn, Dark Moon deity and last born of Gwyn, Lord of Sunlight. We already killed Gwendolyn. Um, he was a fucking bitch to kill. He was such an asshole. Actually, you know what? His fight wasn't even that bad. It's definitely a little bit annoying. His run back and forth from the actual campfire, that's what really pissed me off. The Dark Sun, Gwendolyn, is the only remaining deity in Anor Londo. His followers are few, but their tasks are of vital importance. Huh? Gwendolyn is the only remaining deity in Anor Londo? What about Big Booba Lady? We know that I killed her, but this ring wouldn't know. Also, how the fuck did this ring get here? <laughs> another question. So does that mean that Big Booba Lady wasn't there? Do you think maybe she was like, uh, maybe she was fake. Maybe she was like, uh, some sort of projection thing of, like, remembrance. I don't know. She did die very quickly. She died in one hit. But then if that were true, then why would Gwendolyn be pissed? Because if he knows that he's the only one that's left there, then he wouldn't have gotten so upset at her death. Maybe? I don't know. Maybe I'm reaching. But that wording seems weird. I'm gonna make notes, actually, about that. Grant's additional attunement slot. Oh, okay. You know, that's actually pretty useful if you're doing magic stuff. I'm not doing any magic. Well, not really doing any magic stuff. I have some stuff, but it's not really my focus build, I guess. But that, I feel like that could be very useful if you are doing one. Also, I would just like to say, since I'm hearing the clanging, I kind of appreciate how each of the blacksmith has like a different clanging pattern. <laughs> it's like a really, really small detail, but that they didn't really have to do. They could have just all made it the same, but I quite like that it's different for each of them. Oh shit. Oh my god, I forgot these guys were here. Um, oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. Hold, hold on, I'm getting fucking whiplash. Get the item! Get the item! Okay, nice big soul. Okay, 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 okay. Hello! Are you a dark knight, perchance? Can I parry? Oh, that doesn't look like a parry. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh god, I'm gonna die. I'm dead. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, I definitely didn't fall through the first time. <laughs> Does this one also fall down? Is it the same area? Ah. Okay, it is the same area because that's my shit. Okay. Where am I? Wait, where was the dark knight? Oh shit. <laughs> oh, unless the holes did. No, this was the same. Did he die? Interesting. Okay, there's two souls on the very far wall there, too. So maybe I can go out 
in there. Oh, is this the area? This is the area with the, 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 the wheel boys. Oh, okay, okay. Wow, this area looks much bigger in here than it did when we were, when we were down there. Oh, Jesus, this scared me. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, there he is. There's Dark Knight. Okay, yeah, everyone is just, everyone is here to party. Can I unlock, please? That would be fucking fantastic. I only have humanity to heal and there's another wheel boy. Okay, I'm just gonna... <laughs> This is a little fucked up. Okay, I was wondering where he went. Oh lord, he's coming. Oh my god, the jumping attack. Okay, I'm gonna try to parry him. Oh, I can't parry a jumping attack like that. Oh fuck. Shit. That was the one I should have parried. Okay. Oh, let's go. Nice. Thank god. Oh, that was a little spooky. White Titanite Chunk. Have I gotten one of this before? Oh, I see the Sorcery Boy. Hold on, I'll read the description in a second. I don't- <laughs> Yeah, I don't want him to nuke my ass. Fuck you, asshole. These are probably the guys that the Sorcery Boy was protecting, so I think Claymore should be fine. Is this a secret wall? No! Why are you here? I'm honestly kind of surprised none of this flooring gives out here too. So let me just see where I am. Oh! What? Fuck! I. That's fucked up, bro. <laughs> what the? Okay. <laughs> mm, yeah, I mean, that was all planned. That was all planned because I wanted to come here for my rekindle anyway. <laughs> so, you know, fuck off then. Wait, where's my souls? Was it not here? I thought I fell down here. Oh my god, I can't believe these guys respawn too. That's so annoying. <laughs> okay. Let me see what's over here. Nothing. Oh god. Oh god. Okay. Man, I shouldn't have come back here. <laughs> you like that bob and weave? Yeah, dude. Okay, where the fuck am I? White wall! Fuck off. I'm not going in there unkindled. Oh no. Oh, no. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's a little fucked up, dude. <laughs> No, my souls! Man, I keep fucking losing- Oh god damn. Okay, I need to rekindle because I've had enough. Oh yeah, the White Titanite. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I forgot, I forgot, I forgot. Uh, White Titanite Chunk is for weapon reinforcement. Has powerful miracle energy. Oh, it reinforces divine weapons to plus nine. Let's go. Actually, that will be so useful. And occult weapons to plus four. With the discoveries of chunks in Lordran, the race to locate the legendary slabs has begun. But could they be mere myth? Well, it's definitely not mere myth because we definitely have a regular Titanite slab. So there's probably maybe more of the other ones as well. I think I can maybe kill him. I kind of remember how to fight these guys. I think you just have to hug. Oh, maybe, maybe not. I think you just have to hug their side, right? Okay, first of all, I saw loot. Eye of death. Oh, we have one of these already. Oh yeah, I forgot these guys have magic too. I'm fine with that. Oh, oh my god. Okay, fuck them up. Fuck them up, dude. Shh, I need a heal. Okay, get in, get in, get in, get in. Oh. Oh, that was close. I can't see what I'm doing. Oh god. Come on. Oh, thank god. Are you dead? He's not dead. <laughs> he was dead. Okay, we're good. Now, now he's dead. Alright, give me your Titanite. Demon Titanite. Was this one pulled out? Nestle in coffin. <laughs> what? Oh! <laughs> Oh, you're just taking a little nap. Just a wee little nap. Okay. Does this like recharge me or like my health or something? Or what am I? What is this for? I don't know. Oh. <laughs> wow, look at us. We're so cozy. <laughs> oh. Oh, I hear somebody. Who is it? Patches, I swear to God. Wait, who is that? Who? Oh. Ooh, maybe this was a bad idea. Oh, those are my feet. Oh, I see we're looking down. Okay. Hello? Oh, that's a little fucked up. Oh my god. Look at us. <laughs> this suit looks really good. This is a cool armor set. Tomb of the Giants. Who? There's gonna be these giants? Okay, looks like I can get back into it. So maybe we're not stuck here. There is water. What kind of cave is this? 
This is very pretty. It's like very bright in here. Hmm. Hmm. Secret walls. Oh, am I supposed to climb up this? Pray to Sacrophagus? Grave Lord. Who? Oh. Damn, that's a little weird that you're still jiggling. <laughs> okay, let's pray. Oh, it's a covenant! Oh, okay, okay. Do you know what this kind of looks like? Um, well, maybe not. With all the little skeletons over the body, it reminds me of uh, Nido which we saw in the very beginning in the prologue, but I'm not really sure. It could just be some guy covered in skeletons. It's a little hard to tell from this angle. Okay, sure, yeah, let's enter the Covenant. I got an achievement called Gravelord Servant. You give me something? I feel like it's almost never bad to like go into a Covenant because they, yeah, they give you shit. Gravelord Sword and Miracle Gravelord Sword Dance. Oh, okay, Covenant established. Offer Eye of Death. Oh, what is that for? Before I do that, I want to see what my items are. <laughs> I want to see what we just got. That's one of the best weapons for speed runs. Really interesting. He reminds me of him too, right? Sword wielded by servants of Grave Lord Nito. Okay, so maybe if this is not Nito himself, then maybe this is one of his servants. The Nito was the first of the dead, crafted from the bones of the fallen. <laughs> That's a little fucked up, but I guess reduce, reuse, recycle. Um, <laughs> the miasma of death exudes from the sword a veritable toxin to any living being huh toxin oh maybe this does toxic damage oh it does 265 physical damage 100 crit 333 for poison 600 durability this sword looks a little fucking disgusting but like kind of fucking cool too <laughs> like the handles are the boat like you're putting your hands in but that's kind of cool not gonna lie, that's pretty fucking cool. Alright, R2 looks like it's some sort of stam. Yeah, the movements are slow and take up a lot of stamina, but maybe it's because it hits really hard. Though that was on one hand, actually. Okay, two-handed is a little bit faster. Okay, so my claymore is 228 for physical damage, and this one was 265. Actually, that's quite a bit stronger than mine is. Mine does have the 228 for lightning, but I don't even actually know how much that matters. Shall I offer you the Eye of Death? I'm just gonna give him one. I have quite a few, but I'm just gonna give one till I know what it's for. Covenant Allegiance Deepened. Oh. Oh, so then is the Eye of Death just for this Covenant? Grave Lord Sword is still unupgraded. Yeah, actually, that's true. It would do so much damage if you are able to level it up still. I mean, if I enjoy fighting with it, maybe I'll swap. That's cool. Okay, so Eye of Death is otherwise just an online item, and there's no online right now, so I might as well just give all of them. I don't know what this does for me, though. Covenant and Legions deepen. Okay. I don't know what that means. I mean, I'm glad for it, I guess, but I don't know. Okay, that's fine, I guess. It's so weird that he's still wiggling. Maybe he's not dead. I kind of thought there was going to be like a fight. Oh, I forgot to also read um the spell. I think nothing happens until you give 10. Probably won't find that many. Oh, okay, okay. 10. Gravelord Sword Dance. Miracle known only by the servants of the first dead Gravelord Nido. Giant Gravelord swords jut out in vicinity. Nido sleeps deep deep within the tomb of giants, quietly overseeing all death and waiting for his servants to usher in the eye of death. Interesting. Uh, okay, let's go and uh, take another nap, I suppose. <laughs> so cozy. Oh, look at us. No spooky bitches better be waiting for me here. <laughs> I just needed a little nap. Oh yeah, this is where I got fucking yeeted off by that skelly boy. Oh, there's a summon sign there. Shh. Oh. Oh my god. Okay. Summon sign? Okay, hold on. Loot first. Large corpse. Touch summon sign. Who is that? Paladin Leroy. <laughs> Leroy Jenkins. God, I haven't heard that in a while. There's also a thing right here. Do you think he'll drop down with me? Oh, for the boss fight. Yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. Okay. Wow, you got a massive fucking club there. Okay, let me grab this loot real quick, Leroy. Oh. Beast hat, holy robe, traveling gloves, and holy trousers. Enemies. Interesting. Oh, he's going in. Um, do you think they'll attack him? I kind of... 
<laughs> I kind of wanted to read the items first. One of the best summons in the game, he actually is a reference to Leroy Jenkins. Is he actually? That's really cool. I like that. I love that a lot. Okay, priest hat is distinctive hat worn only by way of white priests in Thorland. Oh, we killed um, the uh, Petrus and his buddies at Firelink, so that's kind of interesting that we're finding this now. It is simply meant to show their position within the hierarchy. It holds almost no meaning in the land of Lordran. Interesting. And then the holy robe looks like it has a different description. Holy robe was donned by men of the cloth. What does that mean? Though plain to the eye, it's hardy fabric, repels rain, and keeps the body warm. Oh my god, a waterproof robe? <laughs> Those dissatisfied with church teachings must test their faith by going on a spiritual journey, such as the ritual self-purification of the way of the white. I wonder what that entails, like their spiritual journey. That's interesting. Is one of them coming for me? Yeah. What that wheel doing? Hey, buddy. Wow, that did a lot of damage. This one is quite good. Oh, I forgot I had souls here. Let's just give it a go because if I have if I die and have to resummon him, I think I have to run all the way around and I don't entirely remember how to do that. So <laughs> Alright, let's go in. Who are we fighting? Oh, unless we're not fighting. I thought maybe this would be a boss fight. Maybe this is just the next area. Oh, this looks a little fucky wucky. <laughs> <laughs> this looks like um this looks like a really giant coffin and this top part here which would be like the roof is uh the lid. Can I sneak along this? No. Hello? Oh. Okay. What he doing? Oh, is this like the master of all of the skeletons? Damn, you got some masks on you. Okay. <laughs> I like how they all look at each other. Oh, okay. <laughs> Hello? Okay. Um, oh, he's making multiples. Well, the middle one was the real one, right? Wow, he's very, uh, not tanky. He's very low. Pinwheel. Yeah, what are he doing over here? Okay, so he's disappearing and reappearing. Oh, there he is. <laughs> Hi! What? I don't think Leroy even attacked him once. Is that it? Victory achieved <laughs> right of kindling. What? Humanity and a homer bone. Okay, bye Leroy. What the fuck? <laughs> that seemed too easy. Um, okay. I mean, I'll take it, but like, that's all right. Okay. Yeah, I guess I didn't have to sit at the bonfire for more SS5s after all. This is a little fucked up, man. All these fucking hanging skeletons. Oh, I missed this. What is this from? Mask of the Mother. Ayo, oh, we got a mommy mask. Let's go. <laughs> okay, Mask of the Mother. One of the three masks of Pinwheel. Oh, I see. These are the ones that are on, on his, uh, well, I was gonna say on his chest, but on his, uh, face, I guess. One of the three masks of Pinwheel, the necromancer who stole the power of the Grave Lord. Oh, interesting. And reigns over the catacombs. This mask belonging to the kindly mother slightly raises HP. Cool. Okay, so if he took over the power of the Grave Lord, which I think if I am remembering the wording of everything, that was the neato esque looking guy in the coffin that we just visited. So I wonder if we go back there, if that guy will be like up and about because he was wiggling. So it kind of seems like he's dead, right? But like he was wiggling and we could enter his covenant and everything so it makes me think that he's not dead because all the other covenant things were like alive sort of things oh that's very interesting i like that a lot that's cool wow yeah we we looking like a mommy now oh man <laughs> all right hello oh there's a the, there's a thing i'm sure go ahead there's also shit over here wow it's very dark Oh, those ones are colorful. There's a blue one and a red one. What the? These are kind of pretty. I can't see though. It's like very dark. Oh, is this not a soul? I thought this was a soul. <laughs> that one up there is definitely a soul, but I don't know how to get there. I might have to drop onto that maybe. Oh, maybe this is just to light the way so that you know where you're going because it's so dark. 
Oh, I see. Okay, okay. Oh, does this loop back to the lava area? I wonder. I'm gonna get out of here. I'm gonna reset and then I'm gonna come back. Cause this feels like a different area. That way I can have some Estus Flask. I do really want to get my fates up to 25 so that I can join Solaire's Covenant. So I'm gonna be kind of shoveling some of my points into my faith, even though I know it's a little bit of a waste, but I feel like I want to know more about Solaire and his covenant thing. And we've got a lot of these sunlight medals as well, which I'm guessing is for the covenant as well. So I wanna see if the area where the coffin is, is gonna be different because it said that he was like controlling the grave lord. So I wanna see if grave lord is there. Oh, do you need an eye of death to go in there? Yeah, that might be it actually. Cause they did give me an eye of death in order to go in there in the first place. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay, okay. I wanna read this. Treasure. Treasure. Have I been in here? Oh, maybe I haven't been in here. Is this a different secret wall? Shit. No, I was in there, didn't I? Oh shit, I don't remember. Okay, let's go up here. I don't know if this is a boss fight or... Oh, this is just on the other side of the bridge. Oh, okay, unless this lad's still here. Does he have anything different to say? He's gone. Where would he have gone? I think it was here. Okay, do you fall here? You don't fall here. I was so convinced that you fall here. Oh, oh shit. I, okay, well. <laughs> yeah, all right. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, let's go. Okay, I got a fucking heal. I missed one of them. Okay, we got a white titanite chunk and a twinkling titanite. I wonder if I save and quit if the other one will come back. Is that kind of cheesy? <laughs> I always forget that that's a thing that you can do. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, I missed anyway. <laughs> okay, I'm ready this time. Oh, come on. Come on. Kill it. I should have had my other sword out. <laughs> okay, you know what? It's fine. It's fine. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. Oh, you can't fit in here, can you? Damn, that is unfortunate for you. You're gonna try, though. Oh, he's actually quite squishy. So am I, apparently. <laughs> okay, hold on. Let me just smack these guys so I'm not getting mauled. Damn, he is, wow. Where does this go? Oh, there's your little guy there. All right, I see, I see. Oh, I should use my copper sword. Skull lantern. Okay, okay. I've heard about that there was like some sort of lantern and I didn't know where or how to get it. So that's kind of cool. Skull lantern of the catacombs necromancer. Oh, okay, so these guys are necromancers. I thought maybe like the sorcery boys of the skeletons might have been considered clerics because that just was asking about clerics and I don't really know why. <laughs> Drips from his long beard lock. This lantern alights the tomb of the giants. Oh, Nito's light devouring domain of death also serves as fire damage strike weapon. Oh, you can actually use it as a weapon, that's cool. Why would you need a lantern in the tomb of the giants? It was quite well lit when we were in there. Unless if something changed when we try to go back there, but I think I need another eye of death to do that. I shouldn't have given him all of my eyes of death. I should have kept some, or at least one. I didn't think about like that being maybe the key to get in there. Actually, this is perfect because this will be really good for that little neck section of the catacombs with the little glowy light things because it was so fucking dark. Okay, and then it's like the R2 if I want to schmack with it. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna roll. Oh god, it hit me anyway. Oh no, I didn't. Oh, there's a soul here. Miracle Tranquil Walk of Peace. Okay, this looks like one of the falling areas, so I'm just gonna be careful while I smack things. Outland Miracle Foreign to the Way of White. Slows all walking within effect area. Oh, this miracle is normally used to flee as it slows walking but does not affect attacks, but nevertheless defines peace perfectly. Uh, this seems maybe like it's for um, like if you're getting chased by a mob or something. So like maybe if you're not wanting to fight the skeletons, for example, you could cast this and they would all kind of slow the fuck down. Where are we dropping, boys? Oh, we're back here. This is uh, the beginning area. Okay, very cool. All comes full circle. Okay, fuck it. I'm gonna buy all the homeward bones. Might as well. Then be gone with you. Okay, all right. Oh, this brought me to the colorful area. I see. Okay. Um, I want to see if there was anything. Yeah, I have a lantern now. Yeah, I want to see if there was anything over here. Because... Oh, is this how you get the... Maybe this is how you get that soul item. 
Oh no, never mind. It doesn't loop all the way around. I thought maybe like there's like a higher up edge. Okay. Where does this go? It's a little fucking spooky. Hello. Oh, there's an item. Soul of a proud knight. And then where does this go? Is this just where we were before? This is just, okay, it just loops around. Well, at least I can see like much better now. Let's leave this for next time then. We'll pick back up and hopefully clear the next area. All right guys, so that's gonna be it for me today. That is it for day 19 of Dark Souls. If you'd like to continue watching, I'll obviously leave the full playlist link for this playthrough down in the description box and all my social links will be down there as well. So the catacombs was actually very pleasantly surprising for me. I felt like I might end up hating this section and that might be kind of similar or akin to Blight Town, but I actually really enjoyed it. I'm actually really excited for the next sort of area that we're we're gonna go into which i'm not sure if it counts as the catacombs i think it probably maybe does but it just looks very different in terms of like how dark it is and also all the glowy little colorful orbs and i don't really know what to expect but i am actually really looking forward to it i'm a little bit nervous but i think it will maybe be a good time i'm not sure guys anyways that is gonna be it for me tonight so thank you guys again so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed as always don't forget to subscribe to me on youtube and give this video a thumbs up if you're not playing it, it helps me a lot otherwise i'll see you guys in the next one okay goodbye.